A Tallahassee man is facing charges tonight accused of pointing a firearm at police officers and harassing city officials after the city removed 85 animals from his home on Gunter Street. Good evening, I'm Christina Resnack. Thank you for joining us. The city of Tallahassee's Animal Control Department took 80 cats and 5 dogs from his home on Thursday. According to Michelle Bono with the city of Tallahassee, on Friday, George Albert Karam was arrested outside of his home by the Tallahassee Police Department. He's charged with making harassing phone calls and threatening a public official for phone calls he made to City Hall. Karam is also charged with reckless display of a firearm after pointing a gun at police. Now, these are some of those animals that were taken to the Animal Service Center on Thursday. Bono says the city was first notified of the number of animals in the nearly 1,200 square foot home nine months ago. She says they worked with Karam and his sister, who live in the home together, and providing free spaying and neutering as well as health services for some of the animals. But Bono says the conditions were just too poor for the animals to live in. And because they're now full, this weekend the Animal Service Center is offering waived adoption fees for cats. They already spayed, neutered, vaccinated, and provided medical exams for the animals. There are still more than 60 cats in need of adoption. And for more details, just visit our website at WTXL.TV.